x squared by by plus cz look at this it says x squared upon by plus cz equals to y squared upon cz plus ax equals z squared by ax plus by uh, until, until now it was okay i think the challenge comes here when it says it is equal to one now balancing all this to one equating all this to one makes it a little complicated so anyway x squared equals to by plus cz sorry x squared by by plus cz equals to y squared by cz plus ax equals to z squared by ax plus by equals one and we are required to find uh, the value of a by a plus x plus b by b plus y plus c by c plus z right plus c by c plus z c by c plus z equals to what options are minus one two one and minus two now now if you have solved uh, you know enough questions on algebra you would know that the one thing that you should look for is symmetry now when, when i look at these equations given on the left hand side there is some symmetry there right i mean you look, look at all the numerators all these are squares right x squared y squared z squared look at the denominators we've got by plus cz cz plus ax ax plus by right and all these three are equal to one now whenever there's a symmetry it's easy to substitute i mean even if i have to go for random substitution it will be easier for uh, us to simplify right and and what i would suggest is don't don't look at the you know this is not one equation there are multiple equations here basically like you know you can compare the first two terms you can compare the second and third terms you can compare the first and third ones you can compare the first one with fourth one and so on right so you actually get a lot of equations multiple equations and there are how many variables six variables right x y z a b c these are the six variables so so if you have to follow the regular uh, process six equations six variables solve for it and then substitute the values here or maybe try and simplify it in some form here uh, to get a by a plus x b by b plus y and so on but then no we are lazy fellows right Let, let's go for substitution see i think the only thing that you need to observe is compare uh, these two terms what do you observe x squared by b y plus cz equals to one the the best part here is we have been given a lengthy equation but no other conditions here right no strings attached x y z a b c can take any values right until those values are satisfying these equations we don't really care about it so what do we get x squared equals to b y plus cz i think spend a few seconds stare at this equation and you'll know what values of x y z a b c will satisfy this think of some values see if you can if you can get the values of x y and z and b and c that satisfy this equation similar values will satisfy the other equations as well why is it so because these are symmetric that's what i told you right if it is symmetric in nature then it's very easy to simplify yeah for for a moment let's assume x y and z all three are equal and a b c are equal now don't ask me how do you know these are equal i don't know it's not given in the question but at the same time he is also not given that these cannot be equal right so substitute values of x y and z let's take x y z all equals to 2 x equals to 2 y equals to 2 and z equals to 2 so we have 2 squared 4 on the left hand side then 2b plus 2c on the right hand side yeah in fact you don't even have to assume the values of a b and c right assume only the values of x y and z let's assume x y z all three equals to 2 so if i substitute x y z equals to 2 in the equation above what do we get 4 equals to 2b plus 2c and upon taking two common we are left with b plus c equals to 2 and if we assume that a b c are also equal then b plus c equals to 2 implies what b equals to c equals to 1 you're getting it b equals to c equals to 1 and if b and c are equal to 1 then a should also be equal to 1 because all three of them are anyway equal so we are done x y z equals to 2 a b c equals to 1 i'm sure not all of you will be very happy with the solution here i mean you you may not be able to digest the fact that you have to you know randomly substitute values in such a complex equation but then otherwise there's a lot of matapachi right who will do all that right simplifying this is not going to be not going to be very effective right i mean time consuming definitely now substitute so we know a b c are 1 and we know x y z are 2 so 1 by 1 plus 2 again this 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 expression is also symmetric right so if this is 1 by 1 plus 2 the others also will be 1 by 1 plus 2 so 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 plus 1 by 3 equals to 1 